Welcome back. So let's see what are the focus assist settings in Windows 10. So let's go to settings, notification, and focus assist is right next one, or it's right here there as well. If we click here, focus assist is choose which notification you would like to see in here so you can stay focused. The rest will go straight to action center where you can see them anytime. So this applies to when you're in presentation, when you're in a team meeting, when you are in a Skype meeting. So anywhere where you don't want or you are doing something like uh, you're doing on a VIP project and at that time you do not want to be disturbed. So priority only, you can customize your priority list. It will, so right now it's off. So let's see what's the priority and you can customize the priority list call text and reminders wipe calls linked phone text from linked phone linked phone is the one that uh, your company gives you and you link it to your account certain people you can add contact if i do it i don't have anyone over here launch people app and then it will go or you can add an app that um definitely not xbox wow but again, it's probably somebody's gamer and that's for that. But this is the priority list that gets priority and um, they can, you can, you receive notification from them and alarms only. This is more stricter that you will only get the alarms and all the notifications are gone straight to action center right here. Focus assist on and right now it says priority only right it will change and it will say alarms only so so what are the automatic rules so these are some of the rules that uh, apply so let's say we go with priority only and during these times 11 p.m. to 7 a.m. so what does that mean that normally means uh, like uh, from like nine to five people that mean they will be sleeping at this time or they will even if they are not sleeping at seven o'clock they will be hurrying towards the office and they don't have time so if you turn it off they will only get priority only uh, notifications overnight when I'm duplicating my display this is especially important when you uh, if you work in offices you have laptops and you go to different meeting and you connect your laptops to different projectors so you just want to show them what you want them to show and normally it's a powerpoint presentation nothing else so if a notification pops up right there a, for example a very uh, a very close colleague send you a text or uh, you know uh, and I am um, that uh, you will get the uh, joke but you don't want anybody else to see it so that's when it should be done when I'm playing a game so <laughs> again of course this will not be for the um, office work and definitely not on a domain so when I'm playing a game again it will be priority only <clears throat> and when I'm using an app in full screen mode that was what I was doing when it kept the notification in it did not pop them up on my screen and when I exited out of that full screen it said that we held back two notification for you I don't remember what they were but they were in there show me summary what I missed while focus assist was on so with focus assist since it will giving you just the priority and everything is gone straight to over here or however you set it it will give you a summary of what notification you had and believe me while you in an office environment it could be quite a few so right so this is the focus assist pretty easy straightforward you can how it's again if it's uh uh, you know, don't know how to turn it on and off you can do it from here but Microsoft wants you to search it so it's their way of 
um, bringing people to Bing search. All right. Uh, if this video has helped you, please rate, comment, subscribe, and share. And I see you in the next one.